Welcome to the Network Attached World provided by Kintronics. There's a revolution going on and it's all digital. Everything these days is connected by that Ethernet cable. Computers have been connected together on a network for many years. And now the new technology has added devices like IP cameras, paging and intercoms, and door access control. Kintronics specializes in these types of devices. Now let's take a look at network attached cameras. Network attached cameras or IP cameras have some unique advantages. They're easier to install since it's just like another computer on the network. You can select the resolution and frame rate for each camera. You can easily connect multiple sites on your LAN or over the internet. It supports two-way audio. There's a very large selection of IP cameras to choose from. And the recording software runs on your Windows computer. You can view the video from anywhere on your network. As I mentioned, you can select the resolution you need. For example, to view a doorway, use a camera with a resolution of 640 by 480. These cameras provide enough resolution to allow you to identify a person's face in an area that's about 15 feet wide. You can select a higher resolution camera where you need it. For example, to view a parking lot or other large area, use a megapixel camera like the IQ 732. This camera has enough resolution to allow you to identify a person or a license plate in an area that's about 48 feet wide. You can select a pan tilt zoom camera for very large areas, like a parking lot. With a pan tilt zoom camera, you can automatically step through predefined positions and sequentially look at small sections of a large parking lot. It records video if it sees motion. This auto patrol mode works if there isn't too much activity in the parking lot. If lots of things are moving, then you may miss something because the camera is facing in the wrong direction. You can use a number of different cameras to cover everything. A PTZ camera can view the parking areas while a fixed megapixel camera can view just the exit. There are also special cameras that allow you to see when there's very little light or even when there's no light at all. Sometimes we use the term night vision for these cameras, but this can be a confusing term. There are actually two types of cameras, those that are called optical cameras and others that are called thermal imaging cameras. Optical cameras require light of some kind to see, while thermal imaging cameras use the light energy coming from the object they are viewing. Standard optical cameras see well during the day, and depending on their sensitivity, can also see when it gets a little dark. But when there's even less light, you need a day-night camera. Day-night cameras are optical cameras that switch to monochrome or black-white mode when it gets very dark. By switching to this low light mode, they need very little light, but they still need some light to operate. They are also IR sensitive at night. The IQ Envision IQ 852 and the Axis P1334 are examples of day-night cameras. As I mentioned, an optical camera requires some type of illumination. If you don't have standard lighting, then you can add IR illumination. Since you can select IR illumination that is totally invisible to the human eye, it is considered covert illumination. The person doesn't know they are being captured on video. You can add an IR illuminator to any IR sensitive camera. There are also a number of camera systems that come with the IR illuminator. Uh, these cameras range in price from $700 to over $25,000. The Night Track system from Kintronix is an example of a camera with illuminator. It includes a fixed focus IR illuminator that allows you to see up to 600 feet away. 
Thermal imaging systems allow you to see without any light because thermal imaging detects energy emitted from all objects without the need of visible light, intruders can be unveiled day or night through smoke, fog, sand, rain, and snow. You may have heard of the FLIR camera. FLIR actually stands for Forward Looking IR, and it comes from the first military usage in airplanes. Hurley IR is a manufacturer who makes many of these types of thermal cameras. Pricing starts at around $25,000. There is another very special camera that combines the features of optical and thermal type cameras. These special cameras have extremely long range zoom lenses and enhanced IR illuminators. They dramatically increase the range of an optical camera system. For example, this high-performance system from Vumi has a focused IR laser illuminator that allows you to read the letters on this ship from one mile away. There are some other specialized IP camera systems available. For example, the IP Deputy NVR system includes up to two fixed or PTZ cameras with a built-in NVR recording system. It can be connected to your network by modem, wireless connection, or even 3G, 4G phone connections. If you don't want to announce your presence, there's a covert camera system that looks like an electrical box. It includes your choice of a fixed megapixel or PTZ camera and connects to your network in the same way that the IP Deputy NVR system does. Thank you for listening and remember that Kintronics provides the system integration to assure that all your components work together. You can find us on the internet at the wskintronics.com or give us a call 